I'm doing something extra fun today. All right, let's continue. Oh, these are kind of fun. I don't know who makes them. Let's see if I can figure out what that says. Janzy? Jenny? Johnsy? I am not sure. Oh, German. Ha, huh. Spielplatz Gemüsebeet. I don't know the words. I know I should know the words. I'm doing something extra fun today. I am going to be shopping at the Good Stuff Thrift Store and I'm going to fill a lucky cart. And then there's going to be a special spot in this store that is going to be labeled Danny's Picks because I won't be taking this stuff home. I'll just be picking out some really good resale items for those of you who can come in or if you come to my whatnot sale on Monday, I'll go to that shelf first as well so you can kind of see some of the things that are going to be in the sale. We're going to try this out, see if it works. Let's get shop done. All right. Oh yeah, just so everybody knows, we love donations. Noah, Noah is setting up our Santa projector because he's like the IT guy around here. He's very serious when he's working on something. <laughs> All right, we'll leave him alone. Ooh, look, we got our little animated Santa. We've even got some uh, Hanukkah items. And then... Uh, coming in here now come in the week before Christmas and it will be 25% off all Christmas items 25% off all Christmas items the whole week Tuesday through Saturday uh, but for now let's just oh goodness I'm forgetting something I need a lucky card Ooh, I got lucky cart number two all right now let's go shop i just want to point this out too if you come in if there is anything in this front little section here that you can utilize and do something with we need to restock it i have a lot more stuff to put in here uh, we keep this loaded with things that we don't want to end up in the landfill so if you're a crafter or a fixer or just need we put like water bottles and things in here you are welcome to take as many of these items home with you as you would like. All right, this is really cute. Look at this little spun glass Christmas tree in here for $5.99. I would probably buy that once it goes on sale for resale. Oh, that is so vintage. That's Santa Claus right there. This is a new little baggy section. Baggies and baggies and baggies of stuff. We're starting to make lots of baggies of stuff. Santa Clauses. Oh, whose mark is that? I don't know. I don't know. He's not priced. Why isn't he priced? We got cars and a Santa suit. These pillows are adorable adorable now again as i said in my last couple of videos i'm not really buying christmas for resale but i definitely i definitely would buy these to resell at 5.99 a piece um, a pillow like this generally you can sell in the 20 to 25 dollar range on ebay so i love it i love seeing things priced right cookie cutters lots of ornaments a little hand painted mini glass like hula Santas, $9.99. See again, I, uh, this is good. This is good for me to look at the pricing because I feel like that, well, we need to do, we do, definitely need to do Christmas sale and bring some discounts into things, $7.99. I think, like I said, we're gonna do a big Christmas sale this week and we'll see what happens. All right, let's continue. Oh, these are kind of fun. I don't know who makes them. It's a little frosted. 
candle holders. Again, I'm not buying too much Christmas stuff right now. Absolutely love all of this Department 56 stuff. Love it, love it, love it. I wish I had awesome. a place to set it up because it's not like your average Christmas scene. This is like so fun. There's so many details to all of this. All right, let's go. Let's go into the general store here so that we can. Oh, wait. Where did we get a Christmas set? Where did we, where did we switch out dishes? <laughs> Set? Yeah. <laughs> Where did the other set go? Maybe so. No. Oh. I'm thinking maybe. Fifty dollars for the entire set. Fifty dollars for the entire set. That's wow. Who makes these? Let it snow. Nice. These are vintage, 1998. That's fantastic. I love it. Oh, we got our cookie jars back here. If you know anybody who likes kitty cats. Mm, I really, really want to come through here and reprice some things. I think I... Some of this stuff was when we very, very first started and uh, pricing was not quite understood yet. Uh, so, and I know I've had some of my reseller friends come in and go, mm, I thought you said you're reseller friendly. We are, absolutely. If you ever come in and you see something like this and you, and you come up to them and says, hey, this is a little high, we will absolutely take a look at it and, and bring it down. So, um, because my team is mostly not resellers, so they don't quite understand what I'm saying about needing to be reseller friendly, but I definitely want to make sure that you can buy this and go and list it and make money with it. We want to be priced in a way that it's good for here and the collector and, and all of that, but that resellers can still make some money. That's what we are all about. Oh, I sold the uh, little chicken plate. We have some great little girls. Nice to meet you. Got a little, like this is a little children's handmade quilt for $9.99, I think. This is really hard to see. I, I, I think I am. I'm going to put this in my cart uh, because I would absolutely buy this to resell. So we'll put that and we're going to put that over in the Danny's Picks. We've got some Snoopy mugs. What are those? $6.99. Yeah, I feel like those could come down a little bit too. I'm going to be doing some price adjustments next time you see this stuff on a video. It's going to be adjusted. $8.99 for the stangle. Because this is good. This is I, I, this is good for me to come through here and go, you know what? That's not what I want to pay for it. So why would anybody else want to pay that for it? So I'll definitely be adjusting some prices. We will do it. We will do it. These are just some fun project pieces. They just make me smile. Oh, we got more Christmas. We may have to get this Christmas conglommed over with the Christmas. This shelf is a work in progress. We're going to be adding another one of those so that we can expand the linen hanging up area because I think it's easier to shop when it's hung up. So, all right, we've got our children's section over here. Look at these, all handmade. These were actually made by my mother. That's how I know they're all handmade. And she closed her Etsy shop and donated all her goodies here to the store. More than likely this one. We have our kids section over here. Who is he? Collection Teddy. He's cute. $3.99. $3.99. Was it Christmas Christmas? Got a big jelly belly puppy dog. Or not. Not jelly belly. Squish, squish mallow. He's a squish. Why don't we have children? Ooh, I, I like those shoes. I like those shoes. All right, let's go over here. We made this new little ocean scene section. Cute little. Hello, hello. Uh, $1.99. Now that's the kind of pricing I'm talking about. 
I don't, I don't want to put this over in the Danny section because we just made this section and I don't want to break it up, but you can always, if you come to the whatnot sale on Monday, say, hey, Danny, pull that item over in your ocean section that we saw. I love this piece. I love this piece, but I don't, we don't drink bottled wine at my house, so that would just kind of be a waste now, wouldn't it? What are these little salt and peppers for $4.99? They are vintage. You know what? Those are going to go in the Danny picks. Ah, there's the other set of dishes. Oh, that's cool that we got uh, Christmas ones in now. Didn't even know that happened. There's a lot. There's a lot that goes on here. I will give you a sneak peek of our back donation room as we go. We have lots of yarn and crafting stuff. We have been bagging things up, so bagging up and combining patterns and such. Anything that we can kind of put together, we're bagging it up. That's $1.99 for all of those goodies in there. Ooh, old sewing machine in there. Oh, we got end mesh nebulizer. See, now that's the kind of thing, if that was the kind of stuff that I sold, I'd look that up and see if that was a good deal. Oh, that's a really, really vintage, like a Lady Remington. Oh, it's a sunbeam. A sunbeam shaver. I don't... Do people collect those? I imagine they do, right? We have so much stuff here. It's kind of fun to shop my own shelves. How about a pug lamp? Anybody need a pug lamp? <laughs> oh, he's fun. We have him priced at $24.99. He is Continental Creations. Hmm. Might have to look him up. More cookie jars. Logical leather. Leather dog collar. That looks fancy. What do you look like? Oh, that's a nice quality. That's a nice quality dog collar. Eleven ninety nine. Huh. I'll look that up too. Let's see. I'd rather be grill side. Not right now. It's too cold. It is too cold to be grill side. Boy, that looks like the kind I used at the 7-Eleven in uh, 1980s. It's an iris. That's vintage. That's cool. We have lots of cool kitchen appliances. Now, that's not something that I resell, so I wouldn't be looking to buy those for myself, but maybe somebody here is. We got our tools and camping gear and got a VCR, a little bit of everything, even a mailbox. That's cool. Small electronics. All right, not really my niche, but I wanted to give it a look. These are old. Look at those, Las Vegas, they're plastic. $3.99, I feel like that's a good price. A little vintage salt and peppers what are you soup bowls $2.99 those are cute I kind of like those I don't know who makes them though oh that's pretty $4.99 Germany hand painted yes that is going in the Danny recommended let's see got another oh look at this with the Easter lilies Three night or calla lilies, calla lilies, Easter lily, calla lily, same thing, right? We'll put that one in the Danny recommended. And this one's only a dollar ninety nine, and that one is a RS Prussia. Yes, we'll put that in the Danny recommended too. This is an interesting old piece here. What are you? You are a what are you? Turnover tag. What are you? Oak barrel faucet. Oh, it's like a tap for eight ninety nine. That is cool. I don't know much about that. It's not really my niche. But it's cool. I like it. Pretty 
pretty butterfly dish, but it's a little big for shipping. Not really my thing to pick up. Pretty art pottery bowl. So look at that. We covered up the mark. Gonna have to have a talk. <laughs> um, brown and beige bowls. Hmm. I feel like, look at, look at me. I'm peeling, peeling a tag in my own store. That's not good. I got the power. I can just move it right on over. Let's see if I can figure out what that says. Janzy? Jenny? Johnzy? I am not sure. But I really like it. I like the design inside. So that one is also going to go in the Danny Picks. All right. Some bronzed baby shoes. You know, the cool thing is, I get to turn the music off for filming. Oh, look at this. I saw this come in the other day, this little, its I think it's celluloid. It is The Last Supper. It comes with its little stand, super vintage, for $3.99. That is going in the Danny Picks. Let's see what we got over here. Berries, berries. Cooking with berries. Got customers in the store, so I'm trying not to be too loud. Look at these tiki mugs, these tiki glasses. I bought some like these the other day. We have them at $1.99 each. I think those are going to go into the Danny Picks. And I spotted this. This is cool. It looks like a log. It's a candle holder, orange glass candle holder. I love it. $2.49. That's going in the Danny Picks. These guys are pretty fun too. They're very, very weighted. So I don't know if they're supposed to be like door stops. $2.99. For the, they're calling them pumpkin gnomes. Pumpkin carver. Look at that. That's for some serious pumpkin carving. Put you up there. And then there's a Carrie Ghost. Let's see what those towels are underneath there. Black Cat Crossing. That might still sell to somebody who loves to buy the Halloween stuff year-round. We shall see. Just like the little turkey. You know, you know, he's going in my pile. 99 cents. He's going in the Danny Picks. You know he is. This piece caught my eye. Spatterware. Spongeware don't know who makes it, but it's really cool. It is $14.99, so I would probably wait for a sale for that. Uh, but that is a neat piece. All right, let's go to the other side. Actually, I almost forgot to go up the middle. We've got a middle section. Look at these little Native American. They're not super well done, $4.99. I think that's a fair price, but not uh, not quite the quality that I would pick up. Look at this little elephant warmer for three ninety nine. Elephant candle warmer. That's gonna go in the Danny Picks. Noah's over there helping a customer. Hamster. Anybody has like a hamster trail kind of a thing. We have like every attachment and expansion your heart could desire here. Plus all these little guys. They're like $1.99, $2.99. We just got those out today. That's how I know the prices. These kitty plates are really, really cute. $6.99 for a set of three. They are, oh, German. Ha, Spielplatz. Gemüsebeet, Dritte Ausgabe der Sammlung, Katzenkinder auf und Dekunts Ries. Okay, I'll stop there. I'll stop there. 1996. These seem like really good. I am going to put those in the Danny Picks because it's $6.99 set of three. As a reseller, I would sell them separately. Probably, I'm going to guess these are 12 to 15 each, but we'll see when we do the recap. Oh, there's more. 
Who makes you? These look like, I was going to say Gary Patterson. These are all Gary Patterson cats. So there's six plates for $15.99. These I'd have to look up. We'll, t we'll take a peek at how much the Gary Patterson plates go for. But it seems like it might leave enough meat on the bone to make some money on those too. 101 reasons why a cat is better than a man. Got any girlfriends need that one? We have lots of cool mugs, little collector plates. I kind of featured these the other day. That's pretty. Sanibel Shores, $3.99 starfish bowl. I feel like this needs to go live over here with some of our uh, ocean. Here, let's put you right there. There we go. All right, we've got chickens galore. Another cute little dish. These are nice little teacups and saucers. Don't know who makes them. Hmm. $1.99. Oops. That shouldn't be on there. $1.99 for a teacup and saucer set. That seems like a really good deal. This bowl has had my eye for a while. It's so pretty. It is Austria. It is $8.99. You know what? I feel like I'm putting that in Danny's picks because look at it. It's got the little impressed blank mark that says TK and then it has the Leonard Vienna Austria and then it has the signature of whoever hand painted it. This is a old piece and it's got a beautiful, beautiful look being a leaf. I'm going to put that in Danny's picks. Look at all these little Lolita mini wine holiday ornaments. Now they are $10.99. See, that's something I'm going to review and see why those were priced at $10.99. Large Kimmy doll for $8.99. Yeah, we're going to look at some of that. Make some adjustments because, again, I want my reseller friends to come in here and find really, really good deals. Piggies, piggies, we sold a bunch of the piggies during my first Shop the Shelves. Those are really pretty. My first Shop the Shelves uh, here at the store and piggies were very, very popular. We've got lots of, oh, Boyd's, Boyd's. I had to think for a minute. I almost had to look at a tag, but then it came to me, Boyd's. We've got these pinup girls down here. I'm not sure why those have not been scooped up because they're pretty fantastic. Coasters. Oh, you know how I love me my coasters. Oh, these are so pretty too. All right, those are definitely going into Danny's picks. I love those. I see a single mid century glass. Boy, if there was a whole set of this, it is a Culver. Oh, I love this so much. It could be a candle holder. You know what? Even at $5.99, I'm going to put that in Danny's picks because Danny might just uh, make some pricing adjustments. This little plate is so cute. It's got this little girl walking a dog and then the little dogs. It has some crazing. It's hand-painted Japan for $3.99 going in Danny's picks. We have stuff on the top too that uh, I forgot to show you. Look at this really pretty frosted glass candle holder, $1.99. And a little perfume bottle for $3.99. I got my cameraman back. She's got her cameraman back. I like this little perfume bottle for $3.99. I think that is gonna go into Danny's picks too. This is a really cool sun-kissed white juicer. It is marked Made in USA right there on it. $4.99. That's going in Danny's picks. Christopher Stewart coffee set. I don't know Christopher Stewart. Empire House. Huh. How many no, I pieces? Didn't see that. Four pieces. 
It was blurry. Oh, you need me to show you again? It's not showing up clearly. Huh. It's okay. So it says it's a four piece set. Oh, it's two cups, the creamer and the sugar for 60. I, that's one I would look up. I have yes, to look that up. Then we got lots of Avon bottles. I don't really do Avon bottles. That's a pretty uh, dichroic glass wine stopper. Yeah. This is good. This is really good for me because I feel like I need to come in here and either run a sale or just some prices. Maybe I'll just run a sale. These are adorable. These rabbit dishes just says made in China. But those are definitely something I would buy at $3.99 each. So those are going in the pile. On to the next area we go. I saw this thing come in. Oh. That's a phoenix. It is resin. It's Pacific Giftware. Tom Wood Phoenix. Again, we covered up the mark. I don't want to be doing that. We do not want to be covering up marks. Um, this is one I'd have to look up and see why the $17.99, but it is a cool, it is a cool piece. Turn back in there for now. That's really cool. Got the ruby red. Does it come? Is this its box? Oh, it has its original box. How cool is that? The ruby red, Cape Cod, candlestick. It, oh, it came with perfume in it. Oh, it's still got, it's got charisma in it. It still has the perfume in it. Wowza, $3.99. This is Weeping Gold. Park Arts China, made in USA, 22 karat gold. And it's $4.99, that's going in the Danny pile. I'm gonna go into Mikey and Sonny's room and I'm gonna get some ticks out of this room. Cause I know they have things in here that I would buy for sure. Not nails. <laughs> Why do they have nails on the shelf? <laughs> They're such boys. They're such boys. Oh, he needs a price. He needs a price. This is fantastic. This guy right here. Oh my gosh. It's like the invisible clear human body. It's, but I wonder if this was like the invisible man or invisible woman kit. These are really, really awesome. I feel like it's missing some guts though. Might, might need a few more innards. Might need, might. That poor rat. It's so sad. This, oh, it's plastic. I did not expect that to be plastic. Bob's Big Boy, Mini Max. I used to work at Bob's Big Boy. I was a waitress. Yes, I was. I did not know that. You didn't know that? That was pre-Noah. That was pre-Noah. We've got Phantom of the Opera. Oh. I wish I knew the words. Wait. I don't know the words. I know I should know the words. I if you know the words, words, put them in the comments. Yeah, don't know the words. Oh, we got a horse hair, Cocopelli, pottery for $7.99. Oh, this dude is definitely going into Danny's picks right here. All right. I saw this guy the other day and fell in love with him. I think he might be a Dream Pets, although I don't know if they made the Dream Pets in leather. I'm still kind of smitten with him. He's got a tag. He's a Dakin. Dakin? Dakin? Dank? Dakin? How do you say it? I, I, might, I might have to look him up because I really do love him. I'm glad he's not in the trap. Just saying. Ah! 
<laughs> Can you get in there, Noah? I think so. So these are, I believe, made by Princess House. I'll tell you what, I'm going to encourage these guys to do a whatnot sale. Because I know this stuff is really popular stuff. That's Fenton. I do believe that's a Fenton bear for $5. All right, that's going in the Danny Picks too. I love this confetti glass. I saw Sonny pick this up in one of his videos. I'm like, yes, that is gorgeous. I totally would have picked that also. Oh, birds back here are really sweet. They are a planter for $9.99. I feel like that's a really good price, but I'm gonna leave that one in there and keep him safe. Little pine cone salt and peppers. For $19.99. These are super old. They've got the little cork bottoms. Now remember, these are the boutique rooms. I don't do anything with the pricing in here. These guys are resellers, so it's it's less than you can get it on eBay, uh, but they still are in it to make some money, so they price accordingly, but they do wheel and deal. I feel like 10 bucks is a good price for that because I super duper love that. It's like it's in Lucite. I'm torn. I'm torn on that one. May come back to it. If somebody in the comments tells me you want to see me uh, offer that one up on whatnot, I will. I'll do it. What do we got here? Cobalt blue with this kind of a fan pattern. Interesting. It's very Art Deco. Yeah, I feel like there's some things in here. Some of my my live sale buyers would really love for me to offer up. So I will, I will get with the boys and see if we can make that happen. Yeah, that's another one that's just really cool. We got to keep moving. We got it in Carrie's room. And everybody wants to go home now. Imagine that. It's five o'clock. All right. Let's see what we can find in Carrie's room. Oops. I'm not going to price tags off. $16 for the set of glasses that have these cute little horse and carriage scenes on them. Some black stemware. I know Carrie's getting ready to bring in a whole bunch more stuff. <gasps> we got a trinket box. You know, I love trinket. I need to have a trinket box sale. I have so many trinket boxes. 15. That's a really good price for that. Really good price for that. 10 on this one. It's a little purse. Let's see. She's got her Barbie plates in here. Her hankies. I love these things. I don't even really know what I would do with them, but I love them so much. They're $6. or are little trumpet flower ornaments, and they got a bead on the inside. They're just fun. Super fun. Books. She's got lots of cool vintage clothing. She's got lots of the Nightmare Before Christmas, $14 on those mugs. Silver Slipper garment bags. Silver Slipper has been gone for a while. You might recognize that. She still has that big, beautiful piece of glass in here. I believe it's a Viking piece. Let's see what she has it priced at. It is $40. That's definitely about right. So if anybody's interested, you know, you can just reach out to me. I do have a direct line to carry. She's got some cute ornaments on the tree. Like a little glass owl. Like I said, we are doing a 25% off sale on all Christmas items and that is everyone in the booths too have agreed to do the 25% off so if you see a Christmas item in here come and get it next week because Carrie says yeah I'm in and her salt and pepper collection is amazing look at the little toilets I'm not sure I'd want my salt and pepper out of a toilet but it's a fun collectible 
do like these roosters too. Creamer and sugar for $16. That, that seems like a good price. You know what? Those are going to go on the Danny Pick shelf. I am in uh, Will and Harleen's room. I know a lot of people have asked about this, so I'm planning to run this in my Monday Whatnot sale because lots and lots of people have asked me about, it's a Taxco Sterling Silver bracelet, and uh, we will go ahead and run that on Monday in my Whatnot sale at 3 p.m. Pacific time. Oh, these cookie cut, blah, 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 I can talk. Cookie cutters, these cookie cutters are fun. Nice, easy grip. They're Wilton's. Oh! Apparently the, uh, the packaging is not easy grip. They are five bucks each. Lots of little uh, Hess miniature. I was, I was looking at this and I was drawn to this, so I couldn't even finish my thought over here. Badoo, 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 Hess trucks. <laughs> but this is awesome. Oh my gosh, just, I, I'll show you Crystal's room in a minute. I feel like Crystal could take this and make one of her little assemblage things in this, like lickety split and just really make this look good. It's $30, which as a, if I was a collector of such things, I would have no problem paying that. We got some tiki stuff. I see some dolphins. I'm looking for my favorites in here, though. I do love this little nativity set. And again, they're on board with the 25% off sale next week. Ooh, dragonware. Now, I don't want to take it. I don't want to take the little stuff out of here because then it has the potential to get stolen out on the shelf that I'm putting things. But if not for that reason, I would be grabbing that and putting that out. Same with the items in this case. You know, I would be grabbing the little bluebird of happiness and this candle holder for just $15. But we'll keep them safe in here. And the uh, John Perry statue for $15. Such fun items in here. Look at these girls. <laughs> that is great. Great, great, great. $10 and then it's going to be 25% off when we open on Tuesday. This is a nice, nice piece. Oh, goodness gracious. This looks like Weller or, um, um, oh gosh, what, why is my brain doing this? Who's the other one that, uh, Weller and the other one that it looks just like this one. That is a fantastic piece. It is marked. The mark is really hard to see. $26. I feel like that's probably worth more than 26. Oh, I didn't even notice the bittersweet back here. You guys probably noticed the bittersweet back here. Although I don't think it is bittersweet. It is um, slag glass. It's a slag. It's like a bittersweet slag. Is that possible? 120. Yeah, I don't blame them for putting that price on that. That's a pretty rare piece right there. I can't help myself. I just can't help myself. The blendo is spectacular, including this piece. Again, I don't want to take anything out of here and put it on the shelf just because it looks so good on the shelves in here. So um, just come in and shop this booth. This mug right here is super cool. It's got the pine, no. I wanted to say it's a pine cone. Is it a pine cone? I think it is. Okay, for a minute I thought it was a fish. Is it a goldfish or a pine cone? No, it's a pine cone. Pretty sure. I'm still torn. Um, Durang pine cone. Yeah. Pottery. I can't read what that's. Murray? Murray pottery? Rum? Murray? I don't know. But you know what? I do know I like it. And that's going on my picks. We've got a Pioneer Woman utensils. 15 that's a super cool piece i know pioneer woman stuff it really sells for good money this is delft blue for 18 dollars. oh my gosh i love everything in her booth 
I love their eye for things. $18. I don't know what that says on there. Jazzic? Jazzic? 96. You know what? That's going on Danny's uh, picks because I absolutely love it. All right. I didn't even notice there was a fairy lamp on. Oh, there's a candle in it. For $45, it is a Fenton. It's signed. Beautiful, beautiful fairy lamp that I wanted to highlight. The little Degas Ballerina boxes. Gorgeous, too, for $24. Oh, that looks like a really nice piece. They have some really nice pieces. Oh, that's signed. Who's that signed by Noah? I can't read it. I can almost read it. Almost. I can't Handmade. I'll let you pick it up and look at it. Handmade crystal. Badash, Poland. Badash, Poland. And then we've got a hen on nest. She's $25. I wonder if he glows. Wait, we can find out in their room because they got a glower. They, oh, see? No glow on this one. Everything else on the shelf, the glows. Glows. All right, now we are in Tiffany's room. Tiffany, thrifting Vegas. Let's see. She also is in on the Christmas sale. So anything Christmas in her room is going to be 25% off. Oh, my gosh. Christmas. Those are little trees, Noah. I might need those. Do you want those? You like the little trees? I might need those. Of course you do. Of course you do. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I like this fish. He is magnificent. Who is he by? He looks Italian. Oops, I'm not even showing him. He looks Italian. He is uh, Boca, Baca, Boca. He's from Macy's. She hasn't priced at 48. He's pretty spectacular. And if you see anything in Tiffany's room, you are always free to reach out to Tiffany and wheel and deal. And then she'll let us know that she made a deal with you. I believe, oh, I, I'm trying to think of her email address. It's, I don't remember. Okay, I'll have it down in the description. I will have Tiffany's email address down in the description. If you see something you have to have in her booth and you want to wheel and deal with her, you are welcome to do that. She does have some really pretty things, and she has a lot of Christmas in here. So there's going to be a lot of stuff that's going to go on sale when we open up on Tuesday. <laughs> that's a fun mug right there. Pac-Man. Life is a journey. Wear comfy shoes. Is that a life is good? It is a life is good. For $14.99. She also has lots of ornaments. Her pretty little white tinsel tree. The punch bowl. Probably would be one of my favorite things in her room, but we are not moving that out to the shelf. Ooh, that's pretty. Look at that. That is Latterman double oil burner. I love that. That's going out on a Danny pick. Lots of great little art pottery pieces, signed pieces. Fighting kitty cats. Another really pretty little vase for $11.99. I'm going to put that one out on the Danny picks as well. All right, everybody wants to go home and they're waiting on me to finish filming this darn video. <laughs> so we're almost there. We are in some of the front cases that we have here. I do like, I do like those. Oh, we open this case and take a peek. These would have had little crystal prisms on them, which are pretty easily replaced. These are priced at $30 for the pair. I really love these. Again, I would have to look up and remember what those sell for. If I were to be buying them for resale, of course. If you're a collector though, I feel like that's a really good price. All right, a 
see a bird. Lots of pretty stuff. Oh, I didn't even know we had another John Perry dolphin in there. Look at him. He's cool. $24.99. Mm -hmm. Might end up with him. Obviously, we have lots of clothes. We have lots of things that all the thrift stores have and I don't generally shop the shelves on those but I wanted to show you look at all these these are all brand new with tags LuLaRoe leggings and the tops all brand new with tags in all sizes so and they're all Disney did I mention they're all Disney ha huh. that's the cool thing because um, LuLaRoe in itself isn't exciting but Disney is exciting I'm gonna finish up right here at my little table of goodness. Yep, you did just see me buy this. And I brought it here because, as I was telling you, uh, what you didn't see on that video was the cracked lid, but it is treasure craft. I was able to verify that by opening the lid right there. Still a very, very rare um, cookie jar. And I have it priced at just $29.99. If it didn't have that broken lid, it would be 50 to 60. So let's see what other cool things we have. Red glass vase. <laughs> and that's going to be part of the Christmas sale as well. Because, you know, it's Christmassy. Yep, you probably saw me pick those up too. It was just better to bring those here than to try to that ship them. These are really cute little, little ornaments tinsel in a tangle tinsel don't get your tinsel in a tangle and the elves made me do it is what those say that's cute all right we also have this Jim Shore nativity which is pretty fantastic we have this Jim Shore gold and black Santa that is fantastic fun 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 stuff all right, you know, at one last place, I'm going to peek. It's in the case of Littles. And I tell you what, I don't, hi Noah, I don't want to take things out of this case and put them over there either because the chance of them then getting stolen is very high. Uh, but this, this um, tree topper, I believe is quite old. Whoops, I just dropped the price tag on the floor. But look, at it's like a mercury glass inside there and it's got all of the little fine glittery enameling on it i think we put like oh she put 20 bucks on it all right all right but it's going to be 25 percent off so it's going to be what like 15 dollars and little stuff little stuff cute little skunk for just a dollar 99 that's pretty. Look at the beads on that. Is that? Mm, I don't think it's. I don't think it's malachite. It's made to look like malachite, though. And glasses. Lots of glasses. And here's the fabulous Crystal's room, with her Pyrex jewelry and her little assemblages. This is what I was talking about. How she takes these little vintage items and she makes the coolest things with them. She just brought in. She just brought this one in today so fabulous and she's also 25 percent off on her christmas items got the little santa mug the one there the pepsi bottle i showed some of this on my last video that whole crate this is one big big like decor one so it's priced at 59.99 which means 25 percent of that oh my gosh don't make me do the math what does that make it like 40 bucks for that entire thing holy moly I might have to get the birdcage one. I am kind of smitten with that one. But, oh, these are going fast, too. Her stuff goes really fast. I'm not going to pull anything out of her room. There's absolutely no reason to pull anything out of her room because it highlights much better in here than over on my little shelf. But uh, I love this whole room. I love everything about it. So uh, can't wait to see her sell out all her Christmas stuff next week. All right, so here's my little card of goodness. This is what I've ended up with. I will be putting it up on this shelf here. 
and uh, putting a little sign up here. It says that these are Danny's picks. And then on Monday, this will be one of the first things I go to for the whatnot sale that I'm going to do at 3 p.m. Pacific time, 6 p.m. Eastern. So I hope you will for that. And if you've not yet signed up for whatnot, please be sure to claim your $15 of free money to spend over there and uh, buy some cool stuff. All right. Stay tuned. I'm still going to do a little recap, just as if I bought this stuff myself, so you can see the values. And uh, that's coming up right now. heading home and then I'm going to a party tonight so uh yeah gonna have some fun so you go be profitable and make it fun we'll see you on the next one